Hey guys, uh, what is up? This is my first uh, YouTube video, and I'm just going to be doing a review on the top 10 Mac apps for February 2012. So yeah, let's get started. Uh, starting at number 10, we got ScreenFlow, which is the, actually the app that I'm using right now to record this. It's right at the top. Alright, never mind that. Staying at number 9, we got Mac X DVD Ripper Pro. So, this can be used to rip any DVD you have on your, say, you buy, get a, uh, you get a DVD from Redbox, you just put this in there, rip it, and then return this back to Redbox, you can watch this whenever, instead of paying late fees. So, and you can convert to Apple TV, iPod, iPad, PSP, AVI, iTunes, music, anything, really. Next up, at number 8, comes Discade. Uh, Discade is really good for like transferring files to your iPod, iPhone, or iPad. And yeah, so let it load. So yeah, my device isn't connected, but like you know, and uh, it's pretty awesome. I love it. You can transfer music. You can transfer music from your iPod to your computer. Yeah. So, staying at number seven, we got Toast Titanium, and that's a really good app for like burning music, D movies, anything really. Uh, Blu-ray movies, DVD movies, high definition movies, video TS folders, audio, or just regular data, Mac, PC, photos, and you can even copy a disc. And uh, just staying at number six, we got Candy Bar. Candy Bar is the app, it's a, it's a really good app for customizing your uh, Mac icons, dock, and everything. So, like, right here I got VLC. It's a Joker. It's like a Joker, like, icon thing. And uh, my dock is, like, green and white. And, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So, staying at number five, we got Total Finder. Oops. Uh... It's, I'm pretty sure a lot of you have heard of it. You can have tabs on your finder. Say, like, I want to uh, drag and drop, a, like, a file, like Angry Birds, to my uh, external hard drive. I just drag it and drop. Yeah. So, sitting at number four, we got Alfred. This is a really good app. Uh, you can just, like, press the command you choose and then... Just search up something like, say, I'm searching up how to be epic. I don't know. And then just search it up, searches it up for you. Okay, saying at number three, you got Microsoft Office 2011. That is a really good app. I'm pretty sure all of you have heard of it. It's amazing that you can use it for school documents, PowerPoints, Excel, all that stuff. Staying at number two, we got Mac Keeper. Mac Keeper is a really good app for cleaning your Mac and uh, antivirus. It's got any theft, data encryptor, file recovery, shredder, backup, cloud. It's not out yet, but whatever. Fast cleanup, just click start scan. Scans for a bunch of junk. Duplicate finder, file finder, disk usage, smart installer, update tracker, login items, default apps. It's really good. So I recommend it a lot, highly. Staying at number one. Pretty sure most of you have heard of this. It's caffeine. Caffeine. Uh, it, you can you just click the coffee icon on the top, and then your thing, your computer never goes to sleep. So, say you're watching a movie, you don't want your, you don't want, you don't want your display to go to sleep. So just click the coffee icon, and then boom, it won't go to sleep anymore. And if say I use it a lot because when I'm downloading stuff, I want to go to sleep to stop downloading. So I just click this, and then go have a cup of coffee, coffee or something. And let this thing download. So, yep, that's it, guys. Stay tuned for more.